Okay, first of all, when we arrive at Jupiter, we're going way too fast to go into orbit. So we fire the main engine for 35 minutes. That slows us down so that we can get captured into orbit. Then we'll do two 53-day orbits, check out our instruments and see if there's any surprises that Jupiter will throw away. Then we fire the main engine one last time, and that reduces our orbit to 14 days. So now we're on a two-week cadence, and the radiation clock is ticking, uh, but we have 16 months of 14-day orbits. That's 33 orbits to get all of our science data. If you wanted to pick, aside from the sun, the scariest environments we know of to send a spacecraft to, <laughs> Jupiter would be the place to go because Jupiter has this gigantic magnetic field which traps a lot of charged particles that get accelerated along the magnetic field lines. It builds up this huge radiation field. If we were to leave our spacecraft bathing in that radiation, it's just not designed to deal with that. So we're going to go through the radiation belts to get into orbit and then we'll be going in and out of the radiation belts as we do our science phase. 